Uh, you know, as the office of the senator, this is not the first time we, our focus has always been on youth empowerment and uh, sporting. Uh, we also recognize that matters education and um, sports go hand in hand. Actually, sport is a very essential element of education. So um, we have been working closely with the school uh, since um, the uh, exercise began. And we thought it wise just to uh, come and have a short discussion with the players before they leave and the entire school just to wish them all the best. Uh, but besides that, we also brought them some financial support uh, in a small way that would ensure that their comfort uh, uh, is considered when, when, before and during the plays. The intention of this as an office is also to pass the message to other students or schools that sporting remains a key element of education. I had asked a doctor to actually a medical practitioner to accompany the team with medicine to ensure that they deal with our injuries. I didn't even know how we are going to deal with the, his uh, stay in Kisi and uh, uh, you know, managing him because he's doing his work. Now this will go a long way to also support our team so that we don't have just scouts fumbling with the players. We want to have a professional doctor dealing with, the, with, the, with, the, with, the, with our, our injuries and we are going with him right today because now we have been empowered. The school has been lucky because it partners with the Michael Olunga Football Academy. And uh, the Michael Olunga Football Academy has given us a donation that would possibly go to the tune of about 500,000 things for this tournament. And uh, it has not come in terms of cash. He has given us high quality imported sets of uniforms, three of them, the red, the white, and the green. The value when you work out is about half a million. And he has also given us uh, 15 new fast balls, which are also carrying the tournament, which will go a long way in uh, building our capacity to compete at the regional. The team has trained well over the December holidays. The team was in the camp training. We never went home. Every holiday the team was also in the school training. So if all goes well, I think we are going to lift this trophy which we missed last year. This time around, I think we are prepared enough. And even the support we have got, we have been given by the leaders of Kisum. We are very happy. When we go there, we'll prove to the, to the Kisumu County that we are good and we'll, we'll, we'll come back with the trophy.